lovely day in Arica, heading up Ben Narnain and Ben Eam. You can see Star going up through the forest behind us. Lovely day and you can see Arica behind me. We've just started up uh, from sea level and um, I'll show you the little path that you come out onto. So, you come up that wee path there and then you're onto the fire trail just for a short 10 metres and then you can see my daughter heading up there on a small track which hopefully will become a bit better the further up we go. We've been walking up something that might be a path or might be a wee stream and uh, now it just kind of separates so we'll see if it becomes a bit drier at this point. our way up Ben Narnain, it's quite a direct path up from the side of Loch Long. Um, you can see that won't be the summit there, but uh, you can see that we're starting to gain some height. We've left the trees just a few minutes ago, and you can see, you can just see Arachar, and then over there you can see Ben Lomond. So, working our way up and we'll see how we get on. Gaining some height, quite a lot of false summits uh, on Ben Narnain and we're working our way up. You can just see the path, it's a good path on the way up. No difficulty at all. And you can see it's a lovely blue sky day. Very lucky for the middle of October. So this bit here is a wee bit steeper, nothing difficult at all, but use your hands as you go up, and that's it. Looking down Loch Long, the cobbler, and we're just very, very close to the summit of Ben Narnain, there it is over there. Almost there top of Ben Narnain looking over to Ben Eam that we're going to go over and do in a minute. Uh, over there, Ben Warren's Dominion and you can just see Ben Lomond and Loch Lomond down Loch Long. We've been working our way down Ben Narnain, you can see there, really good path all the way. And now you can see this path here is also excellent, working our way up.
top of Ben Eam and you can see behind me down to Loch Fine and you'll probably have seen uh, the panorama from the top of Ben Eam looking over to Loch Lomond and so on. The clouds just beginning to come in so we're going to head down fairly soon but uh, it's been a really enjoyable day. I've not been up this way for a long time, probably about 20 years since I was last up in these hills. Um, so we've really enjoyed the day and we've been really lucky with the weather. Looking back to the cobbler, which we didn't go up. Ben Narnane just up there, the Narnane boulders. And in down this path, you can see it's a very good path all the way down. Um, so easy, easy walking, easy going. And you might be able to see the sun's fairly low, so we're getting those long shadows just over there, it's lovely. Following the path through the trees, it's still uh, a very good path, well engineered, so it makes for quick going. And we're almost back at the main road. Uh, and Probably here, uh, back, back at the start. main road, at uh, Succoth, uh, just next to Arica, so uh, that's the end of the walk. It's been at least taking us six hours in total, probably four and a half, five hours of moving time. So, um, straightforward walk, but very nice.